Four spouses sharing one husband is already enough trouble, but you'd be surprised by the disturbing drama going on behind the scenes of TLC's Sister Wives. Here are a few facts about the show that might make you a bit uncomfortable. You would think a guy with four wives would have an especially deft touch with the ladies. But in Cody Brown's case, he's apparently about as charming as a cousin who shows up to weddings in a tuxedo t-shirt. According to excerpts from the family memoir Becoming Sister Wives, the story of an unconventional marriage, Cody described his third wife Christine as a little chubby when they first met and said it turned his stomach to watch her take down a plate of nachos. Cody wrote, I couldn't watch her eat them. She must have been starving because she was eating so quickly, and there was chili sauce and nacho cheese everywhere. He also admitted that he wasn't attracted to Christine, quote, in any kind of physical sense. Unfortunately, Christine wasn't the only wife Cody wasn't feeling upon first sight. Cody described laying eyes on Robin for the first time like this. She looked like a soccer mom. She had a van, three kids, and was divorced. I thought, I didn't need a van, a divorced woman, and three kids in my life. That's just trouble. Sure, these women say they love being in a plural marriage, but come on, there has to be some tension now and then, right? In one 2011 episode, the sister wives admitted it can be unpleasant to think about their spiritual husband having an intimate relationship with all of them, especially when a sister wife becomes pregnant, such as Robin, the woman Cody is legally married to. And just to add another layer of cringe to the situation, we'll pause here to remind everyone that Cody technically divorced his first wife of more than 24 years, Mary, in order to wed Robin and adopt her kids from a previous marriage. There are rumors that Cody spends the bulk of his nights with fourth wife Robin, and Robin only, fueling jealousy among the other wives. In fact, Mary reportedly expressed her true feelings about their complicated marital situation to an online suitor who turned out to be catfishing her. Apparently, Mary revealed multiple secrets to the scam artist's fake alter ego, Samuel, including a bombshell confession that Mary at one point was considering leaving the Brown compound for good because her heart wasn't in it anymore. I spent the entire summer telling her that she was being catfished and she wouldn't listen to me. In a twist that could only happen to the cast of Sister Wives, Radar Online reported that Janelle was previously married to a man named Adam Clark Barber, better known as Mary's brother. According to court documents, Janelle and Barber finalized their divorce in June 1990, shortly after Janelle met Cody. Yet another intrafamily connection occurred when Janelle's mother, Cheryl, married Cody's dad, Wynn, three months before Janelle and Cody got hitched. There's more. Cheryl and Wynn's marriage created a plural union between them and Wynn's first wife, Cody's mother, Janelle. Confused yet? Cody Brown knows exactly where his bread is buttered. The family reportedly earns between $25,000 to $40,000 per episode, according to In Touch Weekly. So it's in his best interest to keep Sister Wives going as long as possible. What better way to maintain healthy ratings than to tease the idea that he might add a fifth wife to the family, right? As of the making of this video, there aren't any new nuptials on the horizon, but there have been rumors about a new union for years. Kendra Pollard, a friend of Robin's, told Life & Style in 2016, Cody wants someone really young like 19 or 20, and she has to be attractive and thin. Another source claimed he's well aware that teasing the intro of a hot new wife could give people reason to tune in and keep the network interested. When the Browns were being investigated for potential bigamy charges, they hurriedly escaped to Las Vegas, where mere cohabitation does not constitute a punishable bigamy offense, as it does in Utah. What that means in layman's terms is that Cody and company were free to live like one big happy plural family, so long as only one marriage license existed between him and one spouse. But was their flight to the Silver State really as dramatic as they made it look on TV? According to third wife Christine's aunt, Kristen Decker, the televised suspense was a ruse. Decker told Radar Online that the family had allegedly intended to move to Vegas for quite some time, saying, "...that was their plan and they used the state coming after them for ratings. That's my strong opinion." It should be noted that Decker has since left her own plural marriage and became an activist against the practice, so she might be biased. In the summer of 2018, the 23-member family moved from Las Vegas to outside Flagstaff, Arizona, their new home for season 13 of Sister Wives, scheduled to hit TLC in early 2019.